is Tommy Gomes. I'm a fourth generation commercial fisherman. It's a hard life, but it's in my blood. I want you to meet the farmers of the sea who work so hard to bring the freshest seafood to your dinner table. The San Diego seafood culture will be on full display in a brand new television show on the Outdoor Channel. It's called The Fishmonger. It stars local seafood expert Tommy Gomes, a former commercial fisherman and local seafood expert. We're happy to welcome Tommy Gomes to the fore. Thanks for joining us today, Tommy. Thanks for having me. It's exciting. And it sounds not only like that, but it. it's a beautiful day in San Diego. And there are a lot of them. Okay, so it is exciting. What is this new show all about? And who came up with the idea for it? You know, my friend and I, Scott Laysath, uh, we were doing trade shows together and talking about seafood and whatnot. And, you know, the American fishermen, they're they're not the bad guys. They're they're not the ones that are overfishing and not reporting regulated catches and things like that. And the fact of the matter is, is that our guys aren't complaining in the, in the U.S. They just want a level playing field. And our country is just, we're just importing so much seafood and it's unregulated and it, it's, you know, we don't know where it's really coming from. There's a bait and switch. If you have a boat that catches it in one area and then offloads into another country, then it becomes that country of origin. And, and all we're trying to do is just get people to be more concerned about where their food comes from because we don't buy our beef, chicken, and pork from faraway lands. I see no reason to buy our seafood from faraway lands, but we still have to feed the masses. So we're just trying to get a level playing field for our fellas, our men and women that fish up and down the West Coast, the East Coast, and the Gulf states. And San Diego, the once great tuna capital of the world, where's a better spot to start a TV show to get the word out, you know what I mean? Yeah, and, and you're showing people the actual work it takes to get this top line seafood, this great stuff that we want to eat. As you mentioned, you shot it in San Diego. So are we going to see other familiar faces, local celebrity chefs, perhaps? Oh, yeah, you'll see you'll see all kinds of celebrity chefs. I mean, we got Dave and Wade out of Wrench and Rodent, Anthony si uh, Pasquale from Saiku Sushi. We've got uh, an amazing assortment of chefs not only that but men and women that work on our local fish fishing boats and we're down at the dockside market which is brought by the san diego fishermen's working group and those fine folks down there and so we're just trying to get the word out about what the big deal is about seafood and if we can get people to eat local seafood twice a week it's great because what we don't understand is that that fish has created jobs in our local economy even before it was caught. I mean, we have to fuel the boat, we have to get groceries, we have to get all the supplies and everything. Plus then we have to buy ice and forklift drivers and crane operators and just everything that goes along with it. These jobs are created before that fish is caught. And these are hardworking men and women in our own community and communities up and down the coast. And we're just doing the best we can to get the word out to know your source, ask questions, read the label, and most importantly, know the country of origin because every fish has a story and we want to tell our story about the American fishermen. All right, every fish has its story and so do you, Tommy Gomes. Uh, the show is The Fishmonger on the Outdoor Channel. Uh, w real quick, we're, we're out of time, but when does it debut? Uh, Monday, 4.30 in the afternoon, this coming Monday. Kind of right. cool. We look forward to that. We actually have a full graphic up here for people to see again. Uh, Monday, March 1st, uh, 7.30 Easter time uh, is what we're being told. Tommy Gomes, thank you so much, and I really appreciate your mission educating people about that food. It just doesn't show up in the restaurant or in the store. Thanks for your time.